Sunbelt fans, every day for the next 14 days, I'm going to take a team and we're going to predict it out. Today's is Appalachian State and how I see the Mountaineers finishing off their season. Last year, they're coming off a six and six season, but due to a couple of one double A games, they did not become bowl eligible. So how's this year going to look? Well, September 2nd, they host Gardner Webb. I see them winning that. September 9th, they're at North Carolina. Even though that was probably one of the best and most entertaining games that last this past year, I don't see them winning that this year. Cross state rivals on September 16th, East Carolina comes to town. And I do think Appalachian State will pull that one out. The following weekend, they go all the way out to Laramie. I think Wyoming's a sleeper team this year that a lot of people aren't going to see coming. And the Wyoming's going to finish the season strong and good. They're going to go something like eight and four. I, I do see Wyoming winning this one. September 30th, opening up conference play at Louisiana Monroe, ULM. I'm going to say Appalachian State wins that game, but I'm also really curious if this is going to turn the, uh, turn the corner season for ULM or not, and that game's going to tell us a lot. Then they have a very weird Tuesday nighter in October, not even a Wednesday nighter, a Tuesday nighter. They host Coastal Carolina, one of the starting to become a newer rival for them. Chanticleers, I just think, have such a strong, potent offense this year. I think in a shootout, Coastal pulls out the victory. On October 21st, they hit the road to Old Dominion, where they pull out the win. October 28th, they host Southern Miss. I think Southern Miss is heavily improved from a year ago, and it's going to be a power in the West. I think Southern Miss wins this. On November 4th, they host Marshall, which if you're of a certain age like I am, this game has special meaning to you. I do think you pull out the victory over Marshall. November 11th, you're on the road at Georgia State. I think you win there. November 18th, you're at James Madison. I think JMU is going gonna, is, is gonna to be loaded this year, and they're going to be tough to beat, especially at home. And that crowd, been there before, experienced it before. That's a loud and raucous crowd. November 25th, it's hate game against Georgia Southern. There's a win. I have Appalachian State finishing the season 7-5 and five overall, 5-3 five and three in conference play. And you were here a couple of years ago, but I have you going back to the Myrtle Beach Bowl to play Northern Illinois. What are your thoughts, folks? Please comment below. Make sure you follow me back and, and like these videos. Thanks for watching.